Session 2. In this devlog session, we'll be looking at our upcoming plans for balancing weapons in classic mode. First, we plan to revamp the FAMAS. Its characteristics are very distinct, with the fastest full auto firing rate of all assault rifles which gives it some impressive DPS. However, its long reload time, small magazine capacity, and relatively high recoil negates a lot of the benefits of its rapid rate of fire. We've also noticed the feedback from many players in the community, so we plan to revamp this weapon entirely. After making changes to both its design and performance, the FAMAS will provide an all-new gaming experience. The enhanced FAMAS is on par with an airdrop firearm. After numerous internal discussions, we decided to add the FAMAS as an airdrop weapon while removing the AUG which uses 5.56mm rounds. Since its launch, the AUG has always been a highly sought-after airdrop weapon. Its incredible firepower, outstanding rate of fire, and unique shooting sound effects make it irresistible for many. But since it is only available in airdrop crates, many are unable to enjoy the thrill of using this weapon. After making this adjustment, players will have more chances to try out the AUG. It'll also become a great assault rifle to use in the later stages of a match. When you can't fully equip your M416 during the mid-stage of the game, you can protect yourself with the AUG which doesn't strongly rely on attachments, and it even performs well in the final moments of the game. Of course, we'll also be rebalancing the AUG, so that this weapon will not be too powerful compared to other non-airdrop weapons. We believe that these adjustments will create a smoother growth curve for all players in the matches. For those who like to use 5.56mm rounds, you can start practicing now. We will be implementing this change in the beta, and depending on the results, make necessary adjustments before it officially releases. Of course, this change will also be incorporated in Metro Royale, so be sure to take note of this change when storing weapons in your inventory. That's it for this devlog session. As usual, if there's any topic you'd like us to cover, be sure to leave a comment. See you next time.